Alright guys, we're back. I'm your boy DeAnthony, I'm my boy Don, my boy Christopher the Conch here. And we are the Break Room Blitz, baby. Blitz. So, we just came back from seeing the Office Blitz. Christmas Party. Yeah. Um, it is a comedy. It's supposed to be a comedy. Apparently. It has some actors in there you might know. Yeah, Olivia Munn. Um, I love you, girl, but they keep downplaying your character in every movie. She but it just wasn't funny. It just was not funny. Unfortunately. It had moments. Uh, I'm usually always the one that gives the benefit of the doubt here. It had moments. It sure. had its moments. Sure. But just they like, did show a lot of them in the preview. Yeah. Basically, this is like a really good example of how they show us a trailer, and they show us every single good part of the movie in that one trailer. So if you saw the trailer... You saw what the movie was. You don't need to pay to go see this movie. Yeah, unfortunately. I would definitely red box this one. Yeah. For sure. Give it a rental. You know, you're gonna save yourself maybe, you know, five, ten bucks, however much, you know. Yeah, it's probably gonna be on Netflix in a couple months because it's just yeah. a bad movie, it's not gonna be in theaters. Yeah. Um, I'd say you, you can if watch you it if you were like drinking and like <clears throat> maybe you made a drinking game out of it. Oh like, yeah. I, I could totally pull. I, you I gotta would, be intoxicated. You know what? We we watch it sober. You know, yeah. So it might, it, might be, it might be one of those. One of those movies. Because but you know, when back in the day, they had that slew of movies where like they're all like the technical stoner movies. So it's like if you watch the movie Stone, it's you laugh. It's the best movie in the world. <laughs> there, you, there you go. Yeah. Sounds um, horrible. I, I, I guess, Break Room Bliss does not so, you know <laughs> you know induct their smoking of the all adults <laughs> here. Yeah, hopefully. And we're in California, so <laughs> right, just got passed. Yeah. Anyway, uh, for but for me, it didn't have any intellectual value. It definitely oh, didn't have any no. comedic value. Well, actually, yeah, there it was some, some intellectual. Intelle- they had intellectual ideas. Well, actually, uh, in the so, movie. Hold no, on, sorry to bring value. it up. To, to, just to kind of no, I'm sorry. <laughs> they, they they did come up with this epic plan to go ahead and, and create you know internet for everyone. They, I just to let you know they just came out with this thing called like a a freaking Something stick thing, and it actually t- it finds radio frequency waves and gives your phone service no matter where you're at. Yeah, but this one was yeah, really was like that. I'm this, just saying this, this one was projecting concept through concept. the devices, not right. the device <laughs> trying to grab a signal. I'm just saying, right. same concept. It was, it was. It was I'm totally like, what? The lamp is going to give me internet? Yeah. What are we talking about here? <laughs> so, because um, we're we're techs, so yeah. you can't throw that up in the in the air and then just think we're going to take it. It really boggled the mind, like when I tried to grasp. I was like, okay, let me. Try to power over Ethernet, Basically power your line adapters. Basically, going to give you Internet. That's but, kind of a, but a but like, what, what throws out the Wi-Fi? <laughs> yeah, just, it's ridiculous. Um, but anyway, for, so, I, I mean, there were some times I laughed. Sometimes I giggled. Sometimes I just, you know, lifted one cheek. Yeah. Um, but yeah, my, my face was getting sore, and I was, like, kind of chuckling every now and then. But I was like, man. <laughs> Um, it took an hour for them to actually start the office party, like the actual yeah. party. The pace of the movie was different, too. He's counting. He's like, uh, it's been 40 minutes. When is the office party going to start? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Surprisingly, hey. Derek didn't fall asleep, though. I was like, I kept looking over him. Was he knocked out? Yeah. <laughs> no, it wasn't that bad. It just it was very predictable. Yeah, it was very predictable. Um, yeah, I mean, there's not much to say about that other than I would skip it. Yeah, we're not going to do a discussion on it. Um, there's nothing to discuss. Yeah. It was just one of those bad. It was a, it was a holiday movie. They just threw a holiday theme on there yeah. and said people were gonna go because it's a holiday. Right. Yeah. Like that's it. That's what I thought I felt about it. Yeah, I felt exactly the same way. I think we all did. All right. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> so, all right, guys, that is our breakdown of this movie. All right, guys. So, are you guys watching this again? Would you recommend it? I would not watch it again, and I can't recommend it. Um, background noise, probably for sure. Um, not, I recommend it, maybe. See, I don't like noise, so it won't ever come on. <laughs> so I'm not watching it again. You guys have to rate it. What are we, what are we rating this? Uh, you know, uh, out of comedy movies, it wasn't funny to me. Um, if I had to rate it, um, I'd probably give it like a four out of ten. Mm. Yeah, I'm actually sitting on that bar too. I'll give it a four. Man, you know, the first thing that popped in my head right now, because the first time I ever thought about rating it, because it was just not even that important for me to even think about the rating. So right now, when I thought about it, I gave it a three. Oh. Because it's a, it's a comedy. It, yeah. it has so-called comedians in there. Yeah, and you know what? Um, Each of these uh, actors are in different type comedies. You know, like T.J. Miller from like uh, Silicon Valley, and I think he's funny in Silicon Valley. 
but yeah. not as much here. Olivia Munn, when she did a G4 Attack of the Show, if you guys ever watched it, you know, check it out. But, I mean, in there, I thought she was pretty funny. I think she was the best part of this whole movie. Yeah, I liked her a lot. I actually liked her character a lot in this movie. Her, her character was in, innovative, I suppose. I would, let you, I would definitely like to see her in some other stuff. Yeah. yeah. And then uh, that one dude from Arrested yeah, Development. They, they topped her as Psylocke. You know, you could have done a lot more with her as Psylocke. So, I mean, give, give the woman some credit. She's got some skills. Yeah, well, man. she auditions for the movies that she wants. So, that's what she got. You can't. She shouldn't audition then. You should. You know, well, as I mean, a director, you should see talent and utilize it. <laughs> so, that's it, guys. That's our office party. Our Christmas office party. No. Office Christmas party. Yes. yes. Can't even remember the name. Doesn't even matter. Yeah. Office <laughs> Christmas party. Uh, review, you guys uh, like, subscribe, share, and comment. We want to know what you guys think. Maybe you guys really like the movie. Maybe we're just tripping. Three guys that just watched a different movie than you did. Let us know. <laughs> also, check out our Rogue One giveaway video. We want to give away a gift to all our subscribers. So go ahead and check that video out, video out and read in that description how to qualify, guys. Okay? All right. I'm DeAnthony. I'm done. Couch. And we're out, baby. Break room blitz. Wiki, wiki, woo.